Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we got some interesting stuff for you. We are here with a list of 5 top NFT games with land value upside that you can make a lot of money simply by investing in its lands. Almost all gaming platforms are now heavily influenced by NFT games, which are rapidly capturing the gaming market. The term NFT refers to non-fungible tokens, which allows players to purchase assets within the game like skins, property, lands, and other items. Not only that, but it appears to be the best way to make money simply by investing it in the best possible way to use digital currencies. Anything that allows people to earn money, such as NFT games, never goes out of style. The simplest way to earn money in such games is simply to invest them in the land, which can surely make a lot of profit if invested in the right order and way. There will also be a point in the game where the cheapest lands will be the most expensive ones, so owning land in such a location within a game won't be wasted. The value can sometimes increase up to 10 times and maybe even reach 100 times what you initially invested. This appears to be, I'm gonna say it one more time, a real life investment, reaping far more than it sows, which is fantastic, isn't it? Axie Infinity, developed by Vietnamese studio Sky Mavis, is the most popular and most expensive NFT collection owning game, well, at least currently. And the game is very quickly gaining popularity around the world, with approximately 2.2 million players on a daily basis. This insane popularity has undoubtedly influenced the value of all of the assets contained in the game. Just like any other NFT game, Axie Infinity's got a collection of assets to purchase, and land is unquestionably one of them. The mainland is referred to as Lunacia. See, the game also provides regular land sales to its players, allowing them to purchase land at low prices in a variety of locations. Such sales can sometimes result in a player hitting the jackpot if their land value increases by tons. There are around three major land scales that have yet to occur uh, in the currently unannounced game. Sources have claimed, though, that the game is making a lot of progress, which will surely cause the land prices to go up by like a lot more than their current prices, creating some hype amongst the players. So I personally think it's better to just be a part of the hype and make some money by buying the corresponding land in the upcoming sales, of course. One thing, though, to try and keep in mind is to try and purchase ground floor land, as their values are expected to rise by tens or hundreds of times. Avoid purchasing secondhand land if at all possible, trust me. Mirandus is yet another NFT game in which a fantasy world powered by a blockchain technology and players have a wide range of options to choose from. The game is steadily gaining popularity, nowhere near Axe Infinity, but still, and is expected to attract millions of new players in the coming days, implying that a lot of renting, buying, and selling will take place, resulting in profits. Land sales are currently taking place within the game, and there are only a few pieces left. The investments will undoubtedly be profitable, so make sure to purchase land before it runs out. However, the majority of land parcels have already been sold, but they can still be purchased secondhand on OpenSea. Although the revenue and upside potential of Miranda's lands are greatly undervalued, owning a land simply grants you a powerful title in the game. So, owning more land simply grants you more powerful titles. Make sure to never miss out on this chance of yours. The town of the Duke and the village of Earl are certain to appreciate value in the future, so if you can, make sure to buy one of those. The Sandbox is yet another virtual world powered by blockchain that's gaining a lot of popularity in not a whole lot of time. It resembles Minecraft due to its Lego-like appearance. Sandbox lands are unquestionably the most in-demand lands available. They even announced a land sale recently on the 4th of November in 2021. The Sandbox has one of the best partners who have purchased a large amount of land within it, such as, wait for it, Snoop Dogg, who has recently purchased a large amount of land within the Sandbox, and he's planning to organize concerts for everybody. Uh, yet again, the land is kind of limited. Owning land in the Sandbox provides its owner with a plethora of opportunities. And furthermore, the value of the land is expected to rise by about a ton of its original value like real soon. Remember that these are the only lands that are going to be available. Not only will these plots generate massive amounts of revenue as their prices rise, 
but they also provide you the opportunity to have a say in the governments of the sandbox metaverse in the future. So yet again, please don't miss out on this chance, it's pretty cool. Illuvium is another blockchain game that's scheduled to be fully released really, really soon. That's why the land is currently unavailable for purchase. The major buzz surrounding this game has undoubtedly been generated by its land sale only. Because the game is relatively new in town, the creators plan to just sell 100,000 pieces of land beginning in late October or early November. Illuvium is a virtual land of beauty and wonder that is slowly gaining popularity. Once it reaches a million users, the value of land will undoubtedly rise, increasing profits in lickety split no time at all. It's also important to keep an eye on these alluvium lands because they'll undoubtedly be the most valuable, allowing owners to mine resources that'll benefit them in the not too distant future. The land offered will be divided into five tiers, with the ground floor being the most advantageous due to its high upside potential. Furthermore, the landowners will not only be able to generate massive amounts of revenues from their pieces of land, but they'll also be able to scan Illuvials, which will kind of be like Pokemon in the Illuvium universe. Star Atlas is yet another game that's hyped its audience globally. It's got some of the best artworks that are already attracting a majority of attention from all over the world. It's a game of open world space exploration and is currently being released in stages. Star Atlas recently released a lot of new information about the kind of lands within the game, as well as stating that in addition to allowing the landowners to earn revenue by renting out land, it will also allow them to vote on government proposals and will help them become a part of politics that's usually controlled by the players inside the game. This game is undoubtedly built with incredible graphics and some masterpiece works of art, so it's not incorrect to state that when it's finally released, the value of land will reach millions in no time. Star Atlas land pieces have, like, so much potential. Keep an eye on them on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, or even Discord. Discord's super popular for that kind of stuff nowadays. And maybe buy one good piece to reap as many benefits as possible in the near future for yourself. NFT games, without a doubt, are the next big thing in the gaming era offering a plethora of opportunities for its players to earn money just by investing in their digital currency. All of the top five games mentioned in this video will undoubtedly benefit their users. They're all steadily gaining popularity, opening their doors for opportunities for the users to generate revenue. Owning land in these games will undoubtedly and undoubtedly benefit you in ways you could never have imagined, so seize this opportunity as soon as possible. Many of the games mentioned here don't yet have a date for land sale, so you just gotta follow them on social medias, you know, the Instagrams, the Twitters, the Facebooks, the Discords again, so you can stay up to date. Make the best decision that you can because the land is extremely limited everywhere, and once it's sold out, you'll never have that golden opportunity again. And alas, here we come to the end of our topic. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and please subscribe for more interesting content. Thanks!